experience? Well, it was an interesting experience. And um, I love the result very much. I think this is a statement. This is not just that the WordPress photo award is for war photographers. It's a very silent picture. It's a very intimate picture. It's, uh, well, we all say this is like a painting in a way. And um, uh, it's just not that kind of picture. You look at it, you might be shocked, and then you forget it because there are so many shocking pictures around. This one lasts a little longer in your mind in a way. I mean, what is nature? Is nature nature? Is it beauty? Is it uh, wilderness? Or is it destruction? Is it pollution? Is it climate change? So we had both, and we voted for both kind of stories. There was one dirty story, like the crocodile farm in Colombia, which was is the dirty story behind the fashion industry, and it's a big, 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 big business. And on the other hand, we had these two beautiful, very aesthetic pieces. One of Christian Ziegler, the carnivorous plants. Very, very interesting because it's kind of a hidden sensation in nature. You, well, you know about that plants, but you don't see how they act, how they attract, how they trap animals, how they swallow them, how they consume them, and you don't see these certain interaction. And this is at the end, a very aesthetic one as well, and informative. And the other one, the mind suckers, the parasites, it's a great piece. A very, very, very intelligent way to visualize something which you really cannot visualize. And um, it's perfectly done. And the story behind, and therefore you cannot see as a picture uh, says more than a thousand words. You cannot say that always at least there's a very interesting story behind it's the strategies of parasites to enter a body and even a brain of a host to manipulate the behavior to uh, manipulate the wishes of that host and uh, well uh, one of my favorite stories in that uh, piece is uh, parasite enters an ant and it uh, changes the color of the body so that birds think this is a fruit because the parasite wants to be inside the bird. It's clever. It's uh, intelligent. And it's um, a very, very beautiful piece. So um, singles, again, we had both sides um, we had this. Uh, we have this black and white picture, touching picture of a poor, dirty Chinese circus. In that region, there are some three hundred circuses of that kind, and it's a symbol how we treat animals. And there, in the whole content, at least in the nature uh, category, there are lots of these kind of pictures. But this was the very best one, by far. This is a single out of a story about poaching, again. But this is the happy end, in a way, of that story. So uh, even the people there in Kenya, lots of them never, never, never saw a rhino in their life before. And uh, the picture shows that how they are, well, educated um, to, to touch the rhino's body not to be afraid of it. A picture which I think lots of visitors of the exhibitions will love it very much. That orangutan waiting for a medical examination. Um, it was found in a, a palm oil plantage, uh, wounded by bullets. And he's so, well, he's so much looking like we look in a situation like that, in a way, touching again. Nature story in the long term, yeah, uh, it's like an art piece. Uh, this Polish photographer, he did aerials 
of landscapes in different seasons. Some of them might look as if Yannatus Bertrand is his teacher, of course, but others, for example, the, the winter pictures are like paintings, like abs it's, uh, it's abstraction. And, um, well, I like the variety in the long-term projects. In the long-term projects, at least there was one big environmental story, um, this China pollution story, which is a strong and important one and uh, an important topic. We can see there it's not as private as the other story. So the variety was very good, and I think it's it is a it, it's a message uh, that. Uh, there are so many different ways uh, following a long-term project.